Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. So I can't do this, I really can't. Hi and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video is gonna be a really chill vlog, nothing really fancy and Organize my Harry Potter shelf and I'll show you guys a bit of my Harry Potter Lego that I've been working on for a few months now Before we go down to have breakfast, I wanted to show you guys a little bit of my Lego build Which is over here. We have the Hogwarts castle. This is the older set that was released in 2016 or 2018 if I'm not mistaken. Neither is the new set, but for me, it's not really my cup of tea because it doesn't really capture the magic of the castle. Which, um, I'll put up a picture here and the retail prices. I'm not a fan of it because I'm pretty sure you have to create the castle based on different sets. Whilst this one is just all the pieces together. And you know, it's more convenient and it looks kind of better. Sorry, let go. Next, I also wanted to show you guys my posters. Here we have a Harry Potter poster. This is the Prisoner of Azkaban which sits on top of my wall and it's above my TV and some other things. Of like a scrapbook thing. It does remind me a bit of like a yearbook scrapbook. So yeah, let's go have some breakfast. Okay, so now we're gonna have some breakfast. I'm having Roti Chai Nai or what people call it flat I don't know if you guys call it flatbread but it's like this really good alright so I'm done with the breakfast so let's go transition into some better clothes because I'm still in my PJs and we are back. Hello and welcome to my Harry Potter show. So it doesn't really look much right now because I'm still collecting things. But if you guys can actually tell, here's the little um, makeshift book display. I'm in Slytherin. <laughs> but it looks like we're in the dungeon here. And I'll give you guys a little bit close up after this. But here we have my books. We don't have the Prisoner of Azkaban at the moment because it's upstairs. I'm reading it. Alright, so the first things I want to add onto my Harry Potter shelf are my books. So the first book I have is Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them. Movie Making News, the stories behind the magic. If you have watched any Wizarding World movies, you know that there's this newspaper that's called The Daily Prophet. It looks like a newspaper on the inside and has a texture of newspaper as well. So yeah, that's pretty cool. These, which is the Harry Potter film vault. Yeah, I'm a pretty artistic person as you can tell. And here we can see the initial sketches and the ideas behind each character and character design. The next item we have are some postcards, but I use them for display purposes. Here we have Daniel Radcliffe who played Harry Potter. We have Hermione Granger bring up some Polyjuice Potion Harry on the um, motorbike. We'll leave the link for the Harry Potter shop down below in case you guys want to get some things for yourself. We have some character wands. I currently own only four wands and I got these at the official studio tour in London. Currently own the main four which are Harry Potter, Hermione, Ron, and Dumbledore or also known as the Elder Wand. This wand is one of my favorites obviously. I I don't think I use it as often as I do with Hermione's wand. And I do have my eyes set on Luna's wand and also the exclusive tour wands which are the Time Turner and maybe the Slytherin Locket. We have the Travel Magic Kit from the Harry Potter films. In here you can have different replicas from the movies and one of my favorites is the ticket to Platform 9 and 3 quarters from King's Cross Station. I did make a small cameo in my first Harry Potter video back on this channel. I thought it was a nice touch to the video and I still think it was. We have some stickers of Crookshank, Fox, Scabbers, and also Hedwig. If you do come across this specific set, please do purchase it. They also have it for Slytherin and also Gryffindor. Okay, so the first order of business we have is you gotta clean up 
gonna do is look at what I want to move and what I want to keep here. Right now we just have a little Lego section. In the corner we can see Draco Malfoy. She was Finnegan and Professor Snape. What you need to know is that all of these pieces I said have meaning. We have the potion classroom. We have the Deathly Hollow symbol. But other than that, there's also a Christmas tree at the back to represent the Yule Ball. Set up or display we have. Here we have a little snake I molded out of clay. And the walls are pretty much representing the dungeons. Okay, here's some progress. We put our Fantastic Beast book here, our Harry Potter film book books here, and some regular novels over here. We own both the British version of the books and also the American versions. Here is the first part of my show. Train ticket, the postcards, medallion. And here it is. This is the wand area and Funko Pop area. Thank you so much for watching today's video. I hope you all enjoyed my little organizing vlog and I hope you guys are looking forward to some more types of these vlogs because we do have some more shelves that need to be filled and one of the hints was the Lego castle. So thank you so much for watching. Hope you like and subscribe and have a great day. Bye-bye.